Dear students, Namaste. I am Kamal Nepal, your compulsory mathematics teacher. I want to start uh, short questions of a parallelogram. Uh, so uh, I want to teach you uh, some very short questions and some short questions. These are important for your one mark or two marks questions in your examination. Okay, try to take the concept and how can you do solve these try to do yourself okay uh, now uh, question number one uh, it is a very short question state the relation between triangle and parallelogram is turning on same base and between same parallels this is a very short question. It is connected with a theorem. It is a uh, theorem related to triangle and parallelogram. So we must know the relation between triangle, 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 parallelogram, and parallelogram, parallelogram. So in this question, we need to uh, express the relation of triangle and parallelogram. Both are standing on same base and between same parallel. So we can say. It is area of triangle is half of the area parallelogram is turning on same base and same parallel. So we can say again area parallelogram is a double of area of triangle. You can see, okay, which is your question. You can answer like that way. Here is only relationship. It is your question, but uh, express the area of triangle in terms of parallelogram may be your question. So like this way you can answer. So it, this is very simple question and question number two. Yeah, it is the third question. Now question number two, what a relation uh, between rectangle and parallelogram is turning on the same base and between same parallel. So uh, you know rectangle and parallelogram both are same yeah, in the sense of this parallelogram. So we must write down area of rectangle and parallelogram are equal. So area of rectangle and parallelogram is turning on the same base and between same parallels are equal. Yeah equal in areas. Now, another very short question. Now you have um, a figure. In this figure, you have a triangle ABD and BDC. You have two triangles. Uh, both are standing on same base and between same balance. Okay. Now, what is your question? State the relation between triangle ABC and triangle DBC if AD and BC are parallel. Uh, you should write down your answer yourself. It is very simple question. Yeah. I think you can see answer this one. Now, number four, if the diagonal of a parallelogram divides the parallelogram into two equal parts, then write the relation of their areas. If the diagonal of parallelogram divides the parallelogram, then, uh, okay, they are equal in area, two parts, that is two equal parts, okay, here is uh, two parts here. So uh, your question may be, uh, like the yes like this uh, into two parts so your equation is like two parts then you should see their areas are equal so their areas are equal yeah uh, two parts then what is the relation of their areas so their areas are equal now i want to start short questions of two marks question number one in the given figure abcd is a parallelogram whose area is 72 centimeters square if e is any point on ab uh, find the area of triangle dvc now you should observe this figure uh, you have a parallelogram and you have a triangle this triangle and parallelogram both are standing on same base and between same parallels. So you must know the area of this triangle must be half of area of parallelogram. Now your solution, the uh, parallelogram ABCD and triangle, triangle DEC are standing on same base and between same parallels. So the area of triangle must be half of the area of parallelogram. So hence the required area of triangle is equal to, triangle is equal to one by two of area of parallelogram ABCD. Now it is one by two into 72 is equal to 36 centimeters square. So think, how can you do this question? Then answer it, okay? A simple. Now example number two, a triangle and a parallelogram are standing on 
uh, same basis and between same parallels if the area of triangle is 18 square units what will be the area of the parallelogram now you should use the relation of parallelogram and triangle in this question yeah the area the parallelogram and triangle are standing on equal basis and between the same parallels okay so the area parallelogram uh, will be twice the area of triangle so area of parallelogram is equal to two times of triangle that is 2 into 18 is equal to 36 unity square now number three if abcd is a rectangle and ecd is a triangle is standing on same base and between same parallels ab is ac is equal to three centimeter and dc is equal to six centimeter then what is the area of triangle ecd you have figure uh rectangle abcd and rectangle abcd and triangle ecd are standing on same base and between same parallels now we know first uh, the area of a rectangle is base into height then you have an area of this rectangle both are standing on same base between same parallels so area of triangle must be half of the area of rectangle now your solution here is c is equal to 3 cd is equal to 6 then area of rectangle is equal to l into b it is 3 into 6 is equal to 18 centimeter square then after area of triangle is equal to 1 by 2 of area of uh, rectangle abcd is equal to 1 by 2 into 18 it is 9 centimeters square similarly another question in the given figure abcd is a parallelogram in which at is perpendicular to dc it is equal to 5 centimeter and ab is equal to 4 centimeter if m is m b any point on ad find the area of triangle b m c b m c now it is a perpendicular and a base uh, so it is a parallelogram so first you can find out area parallelogram yeah here it is equal to 4 ab is equal to cd is equal to 6 area of parallelogram is equal to base into height now it is 5 into 4 is equal to 20 centimeter square then area of triangle is equal to 1 by 2 of parallelogram 1 by 2 of parallelogram is 1 by 2 into 20 is equal to 10 unit square now this in this parallelogram it is your base and it is your height so area parallelogram is equal to base into height so it is 10 now another question it is question number five example number five in the given figure a f parallel to dc a f parallel to dc de uh, parallel to cf abcd is a square a c is equal to 10 root under 2 centimeter find the area parallelogram c d e f now you have a square given it is a b c d now area of the square is l square you know but here is a diagonal given to find out the area of a square in terms of diagonal area is equal to d square by 2 first uh, diagonal of a square is 10 root under 2 centimeter square so area of a square is equal to 1 by 2 d square that is 1 by 2 10 root under 2 centimeter square whole square centimeter whole square then it is 100 centimeter square it is area of a square then uh, we need to find out the area of this parallelogram so this rectangle and parallelogram both are standing on same base dc now area parallelogram you can guess yeah area parallelograms uh, c d e f is equal to area of a square a b c d standing on same base and between same parallels therefore area of parallelogram is equal to 100 centimeters next another question it is your uh, trapezium height is given there height of trapezium is there uh, it is not given it is here and it is your uh, ed and it is these two are parallel lines so what is your question example number six in the given figure b is equal to 16 centimeter be you can observe here it is b is equal to 16 or uh, dc is equal to 10 if dc is 10 this also 10 so total is 16 it is 10 then it will be 6 and it is 10 then you have this length and this length and it is a right angle triangle you must need the height of this trapezium so 
Here, DC is equal to AB is equal to 10 centimeter. So it is EB is equal to 16, but EA is equal to uh, EB minus AB is equal to 10, 16 minus 10 is equal to 6 centimeter. And in right angle triangle DAE, ED squared is equal to AD squared plus E squared. It is your Pythagoras relation. Now, ED is a 10 squared. AD is we don't know and EA is equal to 6 square then 100 is equal to AD square plus 36 then AD square is equal to you should subtract another side it is 64 and AD square is 64 then AD is equal to 8 centimeter AD is equal to 8 centimeter in this trapezium height is yes you have and parallel sides are also you have then your formula is area of trapezium is equal to 1 by 2 height times P1 plus P2. Now 1 by 2 height is AD times DC plus EB then 1 by 2 into 8 10 plus 16 is equal to 1 by 2 8 into 26 is 104 centimeters square. Next example number 7. Yeah. Uh, in the quadrilateral ABCD BD is equal to 12 centimeter. The perpendicular uh, from A and C on BD are 5.4 centimeter and 6.8 centimeter respectively and the area of quadrilateral. It is a quadrilateral then you uh, have you need here area of quadrilateral. So you have a area of quadrilateral formula then solution yes uh, BD is equal to 12 AM height 1 is equal to 5.4 C and height 2 is equal to 6.8 and we have area of quadrilateral is equal to 1 by 2 diagonal times s1 plus s2. Now it is 1 by 2, 12 times 5.4 plus 6.8. It is 1 by 2, 12 into 12.2. It is 73.2 centimeters square. It is area of uh, quadrilateral. Then these are your very short and short questions. Okay, you should uh, find like these questions and practice yourself. Okay, uh, your homework is Write down all your questions and do yourself. Okay, thank you.